afternoon and welcome to Encoder Products live demonstration. My name is Jared Serge. I'll be your host and we're going to talk about encoders, specifically wheeled encoders. So what is an encoder? Encoders are devices that come in two main flavors, absolute, this is actually an absolute I'm holding in my hand, or incremental. Now we're going to talk mostly about incremental feedback today. Well, internally, incremental encoders were very similar to absolute encoders. You've got a light and a disc with lines on it. And when you rotate it, you're pulsing that light, creating electrical pulses for output. Well, we can count those pulses. If I know that I have a thousand lines on this disc, when I rotate this encoder, I'm going to create a thousand pulses per revolution. That's what an incremental encoder is. So if we take an incremental encoder and put a wheel on it, now we can take those pulses and count them and get a known distance or a known speed. I can tell how fast this conveyor belt is going with the wheeled encoder or I can tell how far I've traveled over a period of time, which is what you see on the meter right here. Why is that useful? Well, let's say you're installing a vision system onto a bottling line. Your vision system scans a bottle and says, oh, that bottle's bad, you gotta reject that thing. Well, you're gonna use the distance given out by this wheeled encoder, so as that bottle travels down the belt and it gets to your reject cylinder, whoo, it pushes it off at the right time. You get rid of that bad bottle and not accidentally a good one. You're using a wheel encoder to figure that out, to get that measurement information. Encoder Products offers three main flavors of wheel encoder solutions. The first is our model TR1. This is our most compact encoder of the three. It's also probably one of the most popular encoders that we offer of all of our encoder lines because it's so versatile. A lot of different potential applications for this. Printing, packaging, conveying. I've even seen it installed on forklifts to do the height of the forks. I've seen it put in elevators. I've seen it put on an oil and gas exploration vehicle up in Canada to give the distance uh, to collaborate with the GPS system to figure out where it is. This encoder is everywhere. In industries such as that are involved with Pack Expo and printing and packaging, it's typically being used for an example like this to get a distance on a conveyor belt. Maybe there's a pick and place a robot you're trying to time with. It's also heavily used to trigger vision systems and to trigger marking systems. Maybe you're triggering a laser marker and you got to know where to start. Or maybe you're triggering a line scan camera and you need to have a unique trigger for each line so that when you stitch together your final image, it's in proportion. You need high resolution and accurate wheel encoders to do that. Our TR1 here could be mounted upside down. See a spring on here? It's internal. It's a spring-loaded encoder, so it applies positive wheel pressure to the surface. So this encoder can be mounted underneath the belt, as all of our wheeled encoders can, and out of the way. Maybe you have a situation where you've got boxes coming down the line, and you don't want anything in the way where things can get caught up. You don't have to worry about that with our encoder. Maximum resolution on this encoder is 10,000 pulses per turn. To give you an idea, if we just went to 6,000 pulses per turn, which isn't even the max, this is a six inch circumference wheel, we've now got 1,000 pulses per inch. That's some pretty good resolution, even for triggering things as accurate as cameras. Many wheel options are available with our encoders. You can get urethane, as you can see here. We also offer neural aluminum in a variety of standard and metric sizes. And we even work on, on demand. If you have a custom application that you need a custom wheel designed for you, look to Encoder Products. We're a very nimble company, and we love custom projects. We love a challenge. So our model TR1 here, the most compact, but maybe you need something more rugged. Maybe you've got a coal belt or an aggregate belt, or maybe just something with a little more weight to it. This is our model TR3. This is our heavier duty wheel encoder. It allows for dual wheel as well. So if you have an application where you're worried about maybe the encoder tilting and wearing the edge off the wheel and then changing the diameter, you can get a dual wheel option to keep this encoder running straight. Or if you require a lot of shaft loading to hold it down, Look at the size of the spring here. You can do a lot of shaft loading to hold this encoder either under a belt or on top. Our third family here is our programmable linear measurement solution. So our PLMS is our newest addition to our wheel encoder team. You're gonna purchase the swing arm here separately from the wheel and the encoder. And it allows you to choose the encoder you want. For example, maybe I do want an absolute encoder in there, an encoder that gives me a unique position for every position in a circle, kind of like your watch. This allows us to select the encoder type that we want, whether it be absolute or incremental, we can mount it here and then select the wheel type we want. And with a programmable encoder, you can now program the resolution. 
So this encoder here is actually not fixed. When you buy a normal incremental encoder, if you buy this TR1, whatever resolution you choose or output type you choose, line driver, open collector, push pull, that is what it is forever. With our programmable linear solution, you can change that as many times as you want. So if you're in research and development, you're making a new machine and you don't know what resolution you need, you're not stuck with it. If you're going through redesign, you can change this. Maybe this is for production equipment and you just really wish you had a wheeled encoder that you could change the resolution based on the part your customer's making. Maybe one day they're printing on cups and the next day they're printing on bowls. And they need to adjust the resolution of this for the type of marking system they're using. No longer are you stuck with an encoder with a fixed resolution. This encoder allows you to change the resolution on the fly. You know what, it's 10,000 CPR right now, but I really want twice as many triggers for this camera setup. I can change that to 20,000 CPR and put it back in. This solution and more are available from Encoder Products. No matter where you are in the United States or worldwide, there is a distributor who is trained in our products who will be able to help you technically get what you need. Thank you for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day.